Hi guys! Uh, we have to put the two names back up and we sh should be ready for another round. It is the fourth round. The fourth round and it is, I don't know, against I don't know. It is David Buckner or the David Buckner David uh, versus Buck Rakotoarison Gil. Interesting name. Buckner, wait, wait, wait. wait. Uh, Ooh, burn. We have a burn, burn, burn. Na 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 na. Beckner is do, 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 do. The burn player. You are on not the sorry. Right. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> burn players on the right end. Uh, this looks like a turbo depth stack from far. It is. The, uh, uh, yes, I guess Gilles is the important part. <laughs> Uh, turbo depths or dark depths, yes. Yeah. Dark depths against the the good old. That's like the police. I love the police. It's always fun. That's really straightforward. But we have to write at least three times. Burn, 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 burn. No. Burn, burn, burn. <laughs> And the ring of fire. And ring of fire. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. So, here we, we are. Here. Who starts? Let's see. They just rolled the dice, I didn't see it. Whoa, it's really turbo. Turbo, turbo one. It should be a fast match, yeah. Turbo depth versus burn. Yeah. Who do you favor? I feel depth should be one turn faster, but. Uh, yes. Uh, it, it's really role dependent. I think the role is extremely relevant here. Yeah. And price of progress can do can, something as well. Yeah. He doesn't it's, need a lot of lands, close. but like yeah. he, he needs three at least. And if price does six, it's quite. A does he take damage by itself or not? <laughs> yeah, thought he is really few. Two, thought, two. How much? Yeah, the toxicity is, is also. Yeah, it's just lands are just like the Vernon catacombs that could be damage lands. Yeah, no, no, like he has to he has to buy you, and then w w once there's a death. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Or, or I, 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 I'm searching the lands that deal damage because the ah. says will see his hand, and we, you will not fall into a, a price of progress or more yes. damage yes. than not usual. Yes. This way, the question is, how easily can he kill on turn three? With his depth stack, yes. And also the burn that can kill on turn three. It's possible. It's very possible indeed. Yeah, if if he starts with a goblin guide, the mission is in a good direction. Yes, I do agree. Let's mm. see a little bit. Tictro protection, inquisition, petting in the Oh, this three petting in the By the way, of our Swiss magic masters here in Interlaken. Um, Glad you're joining. If you have any feedbacks as well for the stream, um, please post them. We have managed to get the round time now, um, which is great. If you have any other inputs, feedbacks, uh, rather constructive than non-constructive, of course, but um, we're happy to receive it. And just let us know. Ooh, that's a hand without the Goblin Guide, with Adolon. I feel this hand is too slow. He has just one hand. Uh, I feel like he needs to draw the second land like really fast if yes to be able to compete. Yeah, if Dark Depths has a kind of normal start, we have to remember that Dark Depths without he has not playing blue this way he could break a little bit on the on the start. Mm, but they have a lot like they have a lot of consistency yeah, they in have the form of uh, Sylvan sure. Scrying as a four of and the map and crop are rotation. They playing? Yeah, crop rotation of course. And they're not playing the map right. Yeah. Um, but yeah. this is whoa. This is a good thing for Burn. Turn one ball. Really good thing for Burn. Playing, oh I didn't even see it. He's playing four bob main and one two bob, sorry, and one Ramel Nap excavator. Okay. As well. But, Interesting. Okay. okay. Two Strange things happen that are both fun funny. You know the the catacombs that got the swamp. That's great against the burn deck mm -hmm. in against the price of progress. Mm -hmm. And at the same time, confident is something 
which I is think not you that. would think three times if you know that you were playing against yes. more yes. <laughs> burn yes. to play uh, confident. Yes. Although this is a deck which plays a lot of lands, so it doesn't like he cannot flip a force or something, which would be terrible yeah, in the matchup. Yeah, obviously. But still, like <laughs> one two a turn is is yeah, enough it, sometimes. To I, just I, lose. I would yeah, I would say one or two damage mm -hmm. is enough for the burn spell to have one less mm -hmm. burn and mm -hmm. one less turn to kill maybe mm -hmm. also. I do agree. the The good thing for the good thing for the black green deck now, uh, the depth deck is that the burn deck has still just one land. And Indeed. if he didn't, if he don't draw a second land, the problem is he can play his spells, right. but it will be pretty slow. Right. Now the bird spell should go for the face. Indeed, leaving the bot back. Boom. Um, but he has like he has two more turns, and I think the Eidolon, like if he, if he wasn't a play, this was so much better uh, yeah. for him. But now the Eidolon, if he. If he, even if he finds the land and casts a turn two, I think it's it's not close. But you should not kill the bop. No, 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 <laughs> it, no, no. I don't think you have to. Like, because no, but he's thinking this way. I'm like a little bit scared. <laughs> you know. <laughs> I know. Um, the question is, does he know what he's playing against? Depends on his experience as well. I mean, if you see the bop of spirit guide, I think you you, you come close know, to yeah. that. But if you see the Sylvan crying, it's like a hundred percent. It's depth. one thing that is kind of. Uh, a lot of times it is like the burn player doesn't is not the experienced player a lot of the time this way and maybe he doesn't know maybe maybe it's possible you know maybe. it's more possible in a burn player than other type of players that's, mm, that's most likely true so he goes after the bot um, <laughs> I don't agree I do not agree no, no <laughs> I would never do that uh, I, d I feel like Making him damage was pretty good, <laughs> and he gives him a dark depths with the, uh, with the goblin was it, guy. Was it dark depths? Yes, okay. I think. So it's he has two turns left to burn player. This one turn land drop, second turn land drop, and excavator. there's an excavator which conveniently has three toughness. Yes, and two power blocks the goblin guy. Has Everything going up. perfect for the. I like this point. land, the the land that the burn player has into play. They're beautiful, pretty yeah, pretty beautiful sweet. mountains. But quite expensive if he has yeah. the uh, how many how many are they playing mountains? He's playing like how many mountains are we playing? Not ten. Ten mountains, yeah. No, it's not like ten bucks each. It's ten bucks this yeah, roughly. Yeah. I don't have that in land. I like it. <laughs> this way the prize is something interesting. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's true. Alright. One more turn. Flying blocker also isn't an option, right? Or he did find, yeah, yeah there is it. Yeah. There is the dark depths. Okay, now we have game two. What did they? <laughs> what <laughs> they can sideboard? Okay. What do they sideboard? Uh, as Narang Breach for sure for the burn player. And mm, nothing else, I think. Yeah, there's not a lot. There's both very linear decks with not that much interaction and. Um, I don't see a lot. There's a Toxic Deluge, Surgical, Seal of Primordium, Rite of Consumption, Marsh Casualties, Liliana of the Lost Hope, Graphic Schedule, Guard of Germ, Dread of Night. So nothing that gains life. I, really. I think they want to side in Abrupt Decay. It is better than Abrupt Decay. It's better than other cards that they have. Most likely, it, like it, the Thought Seizes go, probably? Or you try to shape them with Thought Seizes? Rite of Consumption is not the card that you gain life. Yeah, but you kill. Oh, you kill your opponent. Yeah, anyways, also. because you deal oh, twenty damage. If you kill so your opponent, it's pretty good. Um, though it is like there, there are some some burn decks which have like three bridges in the sideboard, mainly for yeah, show and tell. Yeah, he has two. He has two. So uh, yeah, that's the actually a good reason case if he thinks why. about it. I I don't think it's the only reason. I think the most uh, the biggest reason is because you have some cards in your main deck that are just insanely bad. Yeah, like like the confidence, <laughs> or true. the pitting needle. <laughs> that's true. So there's enough to take out, and maybe not even the yeah. thought seizes. If you, oh, if you I, get I saw this in his deck, and this is for me so strange. That's if they're flying blockers. <laughs> yeah, but it's not, is this something that no, they do? No, I have never seen it <laughs> okay. before, but it kind of makes sense. It's the one of Ranker in the in the depths list. I feel um, it's it's so many times a win more that. Yeah, true. It's True, but like I, I understand player it, stalls but you with Strixes, yeah. or like, but it is it is very it's one fringe. time. <laughs> it is extremely fringe. 
I'm I do agree. Um, yeah, but interesting. Let's see what they decide. We probably not. That's that would be good if you could see like the whole sideboarding of the players, but it's kind of hard to do on a, on a yeah. not so big scaled tournament. Yeah, you could. We can see it a little bit. He is citing a lot of cards. He is citing surgical. What? Surgical extraction. Or he's thinking about it at least. Yeah. Is he? It seems so. All right. Wow. Yeah, you're definitely not boarding a choke. I yeah, it so. feels like it makes sense a little bit because you should take out Rancor, you should take out Pitting Needle, you should, you should take, take out, out Bob. Uh, Bob. Yeah. yeah, you should take out so many cards that at the end you're a little bit in a strange situation. Yeah, you have too many cards you want to yeah. bring in. So what do you bring in? I think you keep Toxides, and that's not great, but you yeah. have to keep them. But I if you get a fire blast or something, it's worth it's it. Too it can be worth it. it. It's a little bit uh, worse than uh, um, than gain three life, but still, it's something. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I do agree. What do you think about the depth stack? Like, as 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 a mostly uh, limited player, this is something you do not get to do often. Kill people with lands, right? Yeah, um, yeah. Uh, do, do you like the style of the deck? Does it does it uh, is it? Do you find it interesting to play I this way? I have problems to play combo decks that are not blue, uh, just because of consistency. Yeah. Okay. If if your opponent disrupts you you will feel it <laughs> and you're also r relying a lot on the top of your deck and that's pretty and we score guys we score decent one and oh <laughs> Okay, let's see this this game. I feel like the the burn side can play the game on on this. If it, it is so, f one of the funny things here is that um, that the the black green has so many bad cards, but at the end it has enough really good mm -hmm. things to do mm -hmm. that it is still favorite. Yeah, and uh, like if I it, if it does his main game plan yeah. and it works out, it will win unless the burn player is on the play and has yeah. the nuts, exactly. the, the literal nuts yeah. draw. I feel like he should side in. Probably he could side in, uh, because I I can see also the Sylvan Scapekeeper not being at his best. True. <laughs> yeah, very true. Like there's just a lot of deck cards. Yes. Yeah, I feel like he could side in Broken Bond. Abrupt Decay, because Broken Bond takes out also the Eidolon. Yes, uh, and if there's a Sulfuric Vortex, but yeah. do you care about Sulfuric Vortex is the other yeah, question. Yeah, the problem is a little... Yeah, I don't care yeah, about no, it, yeah, but you're right. at yeah, the you're same right. time... Just to I bring up options. Like, <laughs> I don't want to play Confident anymore. No. <laughs> no. Not at all. Uh, Liliana... Maybe this... I can see that. Yeah. Yeah, especially with the bridges. I like I think that. you have to take it in yeah. the the right of consumption. Not, not we are just talking for about. the bridges, but also just for killing one turn before. True, you don't have to attack. Yeah, yeah. but you need needs, a, you, you need, need two more additional mana. mana yeah. No, it, dep but, de yeah. it depends on the situation because it could also just go. You can go for uh, as as lower start where on turn four you draw like uh, depths and mm -hmm. you go go mm -hmm. with the urbo hex mage and. It's narrow. I, I, I totally agree that. on that. It's narrow. But at the same time, we have so many cards that are just... Also, Sylvan Library is not at his best in this matchup. No, no. <laughs> uh, it's still card selection, probably yeah. not card advantage since yeah, you don't want a portfolio life. Yeah. If you play on turn two, a card that does <coughs> this is uh, still whole, not great. <laughs> your whole turn was dead yeah. and stuff, yeah. But he has, the, he has the start with the Goblin Guide. Um, that's, uh, that's the best start this way. way. Inquisition. <laughs> it's card. funny. It's 20 lands, 20 really bad cards, and 20 really good cards. Mm -hmm. It's so funny. <laughs> Fireblast. Oh, the bridge is there. The bridge is there. The bridge is there. And let's, price see, of let's see if he has price of, com of uh, consumption. Uh, right of consumption. If he yeah. does, he probably doesn't take the bridge. 
If he does, he has to take the rich, I would assume. Yeah. Or, or I guess he has DK, yeah, but I think you, apart from this. you have to fear a little bit this uh, the start from your opponent. Mm -hmm. Yeah, especially now Eidolon on, on his uh, on the second turn of the burn player, if he yes. resolves it, and it, then it will do work. And the price and the fire blast. Yeah. This way, yeah. if he has no basic lands in his hand, and that's not something that... The, he has not a lot of basic lands. No, uh, nor fetches. Uh, yeah, it feels like you c can have a problem with the bridge, but at the same time, I feel like maybe you're dead. Mm. And then you don't have problems with the bridge, bridge. but I don't know if this is a but good yeah, option. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> w what's the better option? That's actually very true. But he, he did it, so I assume he doesn't have right of consumption in this deck. Probably yeah. will fix that after the th third game. Ooh. Oh, the crazy start? You cannot be the crazy Does he have start. A oh, he has the yeah. hex match. Okay. Of course, he has the hex match. And then it's trigger. fine. Oh, wow, but that's how brutal. It makes totally sense. That's so brutal. That's the fastest. Nah, it's the almost the fastest kill I think they can have. Yeah, um, it's the fastest. Is it? They is there nothing faster with like. No. Do they the play pedals yeah. still? No, they don't play pedals. And with uh, Spirit Guide, you cannot make black mana, so probably not. No. If they had mana morphos, they could go for spirit mana, guide, spirit, spirit guide, guide, mana, mana morphos, morphos double consumption. black. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we should make a list of what is mana morphos. <laughs> mana morphos is a cool <laughs> card. It's a really yeah. interesting card. I yes. feel that like 2020 is a little bit too much for the burn player. Yeah. And and the the nice thing is also that block. this this combination of cards makes the price of progress a lot better worse. Yes. <laughs> yeah. There's two damage basically. Yeah. Uh, um, how much how much fast. could he get done though? Like his his opponent is at fourteen uh, fourteen, I think. Yeah, he goes to twelve. He could burn, burn for three. He goes to like six, six and yes, ten. Five lost, he goes it's still to close. Two. Like it, it's still yeah, it's still close. Yeah. Wow, incredible. Yeah, it's still close, but you know, close is it's not that. In Italian, they say close is only good at some uh, curling with balls. What's <laughs> the name? Boccia. Uh, Boccia, exactly. In Italian, <laughs> it's, it's just in this. It's, right. it's useful to have clo <laughs> to be close. <laughs> You should reveal the cards. Yes. Okay. He's still attacking. Eidolon gets eaten by the first striking hex mage. Yeah. The game is over. I mean, I understand people try still, and sometimes yeah. you have to make your opponent do it because yeah. sometimes they just really punt really but hard, especially in later rounds. And people it is fast; it's not something yeah, that yeah, you. It's, it's, it doesn't take ages, right? And there's the 2020 flying indestructible that will finish the game. Okay, and this is the game: two zero four dark depths against burn. <laughs> It was like, it feels like a really favorable matchup. Yes. It is it is funny how a, car, a deck with 20 bad cards against you can have such a great matchup against yeah. you. <laughs> it's, it's so crazy. And all your cards still do something? <laughs> something, like, yeah. Like kind the of bird all, players? And, 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 yeah. But they don't do enough against the 2020 yeah. indestructible deck. Yeah, I do agree. That flies. I do agree. That does other things. Maybe <laughs> question, questionable is also maybe if he should have played the Eidolon. I think he had other options. If he goes there, second Goblin Guide, attack for four, Lava had Spike you I think I think he had a second okay. Goblin Guide. I'm not sure. But uh, I, just saying I'm there might sure have been it. different lines. Maybe it was the... Maybe he drew the Spike. That turn, it's also the possible. Lava spike. I'm not I don't, I don't sure. remember. But still. 